Black Hills Ammunition has a variety of loads for the 300 Blackout, including supersonic and subsonic. And really, your hits will vary greatly because the velocity varies greatly. Chris Serino is at the range, and he has a tip for you on making hits no matter what you're shooting. All right, so I'm just around 1,000 feet per second with my 220 grain Black Hill subsonics. I could hit the target down range because I kind of have an idea of what my drop's going to be, but I want to be more precise, so I want to give you a tip for using the same gun to shoot both rounds of ammunition. Because like I said, I love to shoot them both, and I like to plink, and there's nothing like that quiet tick of the gun going off and that ring of the steel. So I've got a paper target down there, and I'm gonna start off by verifying my 100 yard zero with my 125 open tip match bullets. And I'm gonna shoot at the same point that I'm aiming at with the 125s, and I wanna see what my drop is with those subsonics. So three rounds, I should shoot four because I'm likely to screw one up, but I'm gonna shoot three. Okay, so I'm shooting about an inch high and I'm shooting about a one inch group. Now, my conditions aren't exactly perfect. I'm shooting a little bit uphill. I'm gonna take that. But what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna load up three subsonics and I'm gonna shoot exactly the same picture that I was shooting before. But let me show you what I'm doing. Here's a little tip. So I've got a paster down there on the target. And what I do is rather than shoot at the paster, I lay my crosshairs so that I'm aiming at one corner of the paster. It gives me a little finer aiming point, and this way the crosshairs aren't quite covering the paster. So there's a little tip for you. But let me shoot these three subsonics, and let's see what the drop is. I'm guessing 12 to 15 inches difference. Now what I'm gonna do is, this is a MOA optic, so I know that every number on here is an inch. So I'm just gonna go a full rotation up. There's 12. Now I'm shooting my subsonics. I don't have to worry about holdover. I'm just gonna put the crosshairs on it. That is hilarious. Three shots right in the same cluster as the first group. And now I know that if I want to shoot my supersonics, I return to zero, I go back down. If I want to shoot my subsonics, I come up one full rotation, 12 inches. Now what I'll do is I'll mark that in my notepad. And when I get home from the range, I'm going to take a piece of duct tape or a little piece of anything you like to use. and I'm going to stick it on my stock. And I'm gonna mark down that I use Black Hills, 125 open tip match, 100 yard zero. And I'm gonna mark that I use 220 grain Black Hills open tip match. With 100 yards, I come up one full rotation or 12 minutes or 12 inches. <laughs> 